What is up guys? It has been far too long since I've made an Orioles video. Um, I just wanted to come on here and, and talk a little bit because, well, for one, it's like I said, it's been a really long time. So I want to get back into it a little bit. Uh, don't want to go too crazy with it, but you know, just every once in a while, I'll give some updates on my thoughts and feelings on the team. And I just got done watching the, uh, the White Sox uh, series, and wow, this this game was early in the season and and stuff uh, today. But I feel like it's a season defining kind of game. Um, got got down early, four to nothing, with uh, Grayson Rodriguez, uh, the rookie guy on the mound. Um, you know, giving up the the three run bomb and then giving up a solo home run right after that, and they just you know, most of the time you see that and you're like, oh, game's over. You know, it, 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 this is done. Especially since we had gassed our bullpen. We're going up against the reigning Cy Young winner. Um, and just slowly but surely we, we fought our way back into the game and then just blew it open at the end. Uh, what an incredible team win. And I, 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 can't, I can't say enough about how Grayson Rodriguez, any, any other rookie out there, even most veterans, after giving up four runs in the first inning, especially the way he did, he just looked, you know, like he just could not con command anything and everything was just flat in that first inning. Anybody would have just given up. They would have just they would have just said, okay, here's the ball, Brandon. I'm done after three innings, giving up like six or seven runs or something like that would be how it normally goes. But this rookie, I mean, despite not having the best stuff, uh, despite getting down – early big he he just hung in there and he got that change up working which was filthy and I, I think that the way he handled himself on the mound really kind of kept the rest of the team confident that you know if we can just hang in there for a little bit longer we can come back and win this game our offense is awesome by the way and so you can never really count them out even if we're down by three or four runs late in the game so the fact that we were only down by four after the first, it's like, okay, you know, yeah, it's a rough start, but we can still we can still make something of this if we can get some scoreless innings in. And that's exactly what he did. And then our bullpen, for once in, in this uh, season, has actually stepped up and, and did fantastic. So, I mean, this was, a, to me, a, a season-defining game. The series, we could have easily swept it. It was just, a, you know, an unfortunate thing. We They walked it off yesterday, the White Sox did, against us. Um, other than that, though, I mean, our offense has been awesome. I'd like to see our defense uh, sure up. I don't know what's going on with that because our bullpen last year was one of our strong suits, but so was that defense. And I don't know what's going on. Uh, it's, it's kind of a mystery to me. I don't know why it's happening, but we've been committing a lot of errors, but you know, hopefully we can see that improve. But, I mean, you can't say enough about this offense. This offense has been incredible. And they they walk. They steal bases. They hit for power. They hit the ball the other way. There's really no true weakness in their game. There's been some individual players that have gotten off to a slow start. But, you know, guys like Gunnar Henderson and, and um, um, Tony Taters is what I call him, Santander, you know, he, he got off to a slow start, but it looks like maybe he's coming around. So, man, the, the offense is just off the hook right now. I mean, I think we're going to continue it, too. There's no there's no signs of them slowing down. In fact, it seems like they're getting better. So if we can get that defense uh, to, to sure up, you know, and, and stop committing errors, that will, in turn, help the pitching staff be a little more confident in uh, pitching to contact. I think it's just overall going to be good. It's a wide open race out there. Uh, the AL East is as tough as ever, uh, but I just think so far has been a very exciting start to the season. Uh, it's been a really long time since we could say that uh, at the very beginning of the season. Last year we did uh, have a great, fantastic season, but you know it got off to a little bit of a shaky start. Um, this this year so far, offense has been great. If we can just get you know just stop allowing runs, stop allowing errors. 
I think we're going to be fine, guys. And I'm really excited about it. Go O's.